Facebook has a list of suggested friends for its users. But do you know who makes these suggestions? While browsing on the internet, a page pops up on your screen telling you about an upcoming sale on your favorite brand of shoes and clothes. Ever thought who's keeping track of your favorite brands? All this is the work of artificial intelligence. These days, mobile phones like Apple have virtual assistants like Siri that support a wide range of user commands. So if you think while chatting with friends or watching a video on the internet, you're alone, then you could well be wrong. Millions of algorithms and codes exist all around you, understanding your commands and performing human-like tasks. This is the world of artificial intelligence. The ability of a machine or a computer program to think and learn. The concept of artificial intelligence is based on the idea of building machines capable of thinking, acting and learning like humans. First of all, I want to differentiate between these two terms, robotics and artificial intelligence. So robotics is the platform, is the organism which acts, which can sense the world through its eyes and uh, let's say uh, can communicate with the world through speech or through its actions like moving the limbs and so on and so forth. Artificial intelligence is its brain. That is what is deciding when to sense, when to make an action, when to uh, move, when to speak something and what to speak. So robotics and AI, these two uh, areas of research have been developing in parallel in some sense. Robotics is better mechanical engineers, better mechanical engineering, better electrical engineering, electric fitting, you know, a, a hand which has many degrees of freedom that will come into robotics. Uh, what, how the hand will move, when to move a certain finger and so on, that will come into AI. So this AI as a field has also been developing in parallel. When they meet, that is when big catastrophic uh, or big uh, revolutionary impact is going to be seen. From Apple Siri to self-driving cars, artificial intelligence is progressing rapidly. Science fiction often portrays robots with human-like characteristics as artificial intelligence. A computer can beat the world chess champion and understand voice commands on your smartphone, but that's not a real artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence can be present in anything from Google's search algorithms to IBM's Watson to autonomous weapons. It is different from hardware-driven robotic automation. Instead of automating manual tasks, artificial intelligence performs frequent, high-volume, computerized tasks, reliably and without fatigue. However, for this type of automation, human inquiry is still essential to set up the system and ask the right questions. Artificial intelligence is often misunderstood for machine learning. Artificial intelligence is a broader concept with a bunch of technologies that include machine learning and other technologies like natural language processing, inference algorithms, neural networks, etc. In the manufacturing processes, uh, to increase the productivity and to make the processes faster, uh, that is, I think, uh, uh, is the most appropriate area where the uh, some processes are time uh, consuming and lingers the total production processes. But automation uh, increases the productivity and reduces the time used for the processes. Artificial intelligence techniques have experienced a resurgence following concurrent advances in computer power, large amounts of data and theoretical understanding in the 21st century. Artificial intelligence techniques have now become an essential part of the technology industry, helping to solve many challenging problems in computer science. Bureau Report, Prajasabha TV.